Uh, Sagittarius. The song that's playing for you is Baby. Oh shit, Hermit. You may be you may be going back to your infancy stage regarding an aspect of your reality. Because you got a perspective was brought to you, an awareness. Light was shot like illuminated something. And now you got, it's like you got to rebuild, go back from the ground up. But with that first, first mentality, that first block for a foundation, you got to rebuild something, whether that's how you are. Look, for foundation, a new perspective puts you in a space to heal in order to build a new foundation. You are a baby again regarding an aspect of your reality. That could be for somebody. Or that this could just be what you're getting through. After all that, this motherfucker still right here, and it's like you, you healing or you shining the light on something shows you you probably shouldn't have walked away from something you emotionally invested your time into, something you you gave your energy to. You sh you realize you shouldn't have walked away from it. You shouldn't have stopped giving emotion to that. You may have been able to. You may have been able to progress further or you may have it's like you would have been able to progress further had you not walked away from something and you're coming to that realization my fucking clarity was about to you. Look, overall energy, you came to that realization. First card out is the Ten of Cups. You may be dealing with a Leo, or you may have Leo in your chart somewhere, or a Leo sees you as, look, ten of, their Ten of Cups, because Leo was looking at some, like, this, this was Leo's second card, so you may be this person to a Leo. Or you just have a set, uh, somewhere in your chart Sagittarius and somewhere in your chart is a Leo. Regardless, you don't have to be dealing with a Leo at all. You you are in a state of like something's come to a completion in your reality because you decided to look at something. You you put some light on something. You straighten some shit out because the song that's playing for you is straightening. You straighten some shit out, and as soon as you handled the situation, as soon as something was done, now you back happy. You back in the state of fulfillment as far as your emotion, as far as your emotional investments or just how you feel about self and things outside of you is concerned because something is complete. You as soon as you put to put some truth to some shit, you straighten some shit out. Now you can manifest, you can birth new ideas, your mentalities, your and your emotions can have sex and give birth to new thought patterns or thought forms or just mentalities. You feel me? Look behind those two, Emperor and the Strength. You took control of us. You took control over something because you once you put the light on, you realize you have the strength to take control over something. So you you became the Emperor and put a cup box some completion to some shit. We're gonna get You straighten some shit out. Yeah, don't not get. Don't not get. Look, now you're working. You're working on something. You're working on what? Celebration. Whether that's with self internally, how you think, feel, and like communicate all that with your external world or just celebration with people, places, and things in your environment. The work you putting in, you realize you have the strength to handle whatever whatever you're working on or whatever you're trying to obtain. You have the strength and you are very capable in to achieve that. And that made you happy. And now, now that you've got your emotions and how you feel in check, now you can work on the things you need to work on. 444 when I said that. Your external world. It's like as soon as you got your emotions in check, now it's like your mindset's back. Or, and now you can build 
craft new mentalities to add on to the mentalities and mind frames and habits and hobbies you already do have or continue to build on top of a already stable foundation. So whether you starting something new or picking up where you left off type shit. Oh, our energy. It's either you not fall. It's like you not falling for the lies or somebody, something outside of you is going to try to lie to you. Cause that the third card could also be another person. It's like I don't want to say somebody gonna come lie to you, but it's it's almost like somebody wants you to feel like it's a lie, or it's kind of like it's too good to be true. But look, on the split, we got the Empress, and then we got the uh, Queen of Pentacles. Like you're good. It's just like this is a hater. I mean, the more you build, the better you are. Like, the, the better that means you're putting in work. It's like somebody, somebody don't like the fact that you're in this space. So they might try to lie to you in order to get you to stop working and drop your happiness. Because then it's like, if you, if you listen to whatever this person says and think it's the truth, then you're going to stop working. And if you stop working, you're not going to be happy no more. Whatever, regarding whatever aspect of your reality this is. And then look right here, you're going to be put in a cold situation. That's all, all of that will happen if you listen to this truth. It does, it, somebody might just be bullshitting you, all right? Whatever you're invested in, don't, don't let nobody take that from you right now. Because it, it's, it's, it's something you're emotionally connected to. Your emotion, wherever your emotions is, will take you where you want to go right now. Just basically follow your heart. I split the deck again and the Empress is back. Someone that's playing is, oh, it's an advertisement. Yeah, it was, it's like somebody don't like the fact that you're healing. You got a hater amongst you. And they, they may be real. They, if they're not right next to you, they, they in your circle somewhere. In some aspect. Look, mistress. It might be a mistress you was fucking with. It's like once you stop fucking with them, then they then they don't like that. They like hold on. Why you just don't now? You want to get your life together? The fuck? Yeah. Somebody don't like the fact that you shaping yourself. Hey, good on you though. Let them hate. That just means look. But this is your justice. Whatever this emotional invest investment is, is your justice. This is your truth. Don't let nobody take that from you. Shit, figure out how you can get more haters by tomorrow. Then that's how you know you're doing the right thing. You feel me? As long as you manifest and using the right energies, that is. I'm telling you, somebody might try to give you false emotions in order to knock you out your square. Knock you off your pivot, almost. And it might be a mistress. Three, two, one. See, that's the time. Somebody wants to take from you. Look, watch your circle there, uh, Sagittarius. All right. Don't stop. Whatever you're emotionally connected to is your truth. Don't stop working there. But somebody don't like that. And there's somebody close to you. I'm going to fuck with you. 